Growing concerns about the spread of the monkey virus, Belgium became the first country to issue a mandatory three-week quarantine for patients as cases rise across the world. The World Health Organization is investigating more than 100 confirmed or possible cases in areas that don't normally see the disease, including one likely case in Florida. News 6's Ezie Castro talked to local health leaders to break down what we need to know about the virus. Monkeypox is not a respiratory virus. It's a virus that you get by close contact with other people. Seminole County Medical Director Dr. Todd Husty explains what most of us are asking, what is monkeypox? It comes after health officials in South Florida reported a presumptive case in Broward County. The Department of Health says the case is related to international travel and the patient is in isolation. It's been in Africa for a while, but two things are happening. One is, is we are much more mobile than we used to be. People go from Africa to Europe to the United States and around. So therefore, spreading communicable diseases is much easier than it used to be, and it happens more readily. Monkeypox is an infection transmitted between animals and humans, with most cases reported in Central and West Africa. Symptoms to look out for include fever and headache, muscle and back aches, swollen lymph nodes, chills and exhaustion. Health officials, though, stress monkeypox does not spread as easily as COVID-19 and is rarely fatal. This is nothing like COVID because COVID spreads respiratory person to person. This spreads by close contact, touching people, touching their bodily fluids, that kind of stuff. Remember COVID, we were worried about that woof exponential growth. This thing will not have exponential growth. President Biden mentioned this is something the U.S. will continue to monitor. Meantime, health officials warn we may see a few more cases, but a widespread outbreak is not expected. In the newsroom, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.